Hey guys, hello, hello. All right. Happy Monday. How is everyone today? Hasn't it been? Has anyone else noticed that today it just whew, straight through, whew, just gone completely in a moment, absolutely finished. So today is just getting into the week. I'm full of energy considering I have been detoxing via the immune booster protocol that we have with our genetic pro pro um, profiling program which is really cool because the weekend was a perfect time to go through the phase of the heavy lifting of it where um, the body goes a bit sluggish and your body's clearing out and resetting your flow. But then today I seem to be full of beans, which is really awesome. Um, I haven't done the measurements yet, but I do know that I've lost about four to six centimeters around my torso, um, which is wonderful. Five days and I've managed to shift a lot in my body. So if you're someone who feels like you're in need maybe of that maybe reach out to one of the coaches and have a bit of a discussion about the concept of resetting your body and um and getting yourself uh in a better state of health considering we've just had easter so today's workout should be around 20 minutes maximum um and we're going to do one minute measures so one minute programs um we're going to do a bit of a warm-up and then we're going to go through one minute through so one minute of jump lunges one minute of wide slow push-ups then we're going to get into one minute of dumbbell alternating clean and presses okay then we're going to be doing one minute wall hold then we're going to be doing one minute plank jack so this is kind of like a mishmash of endomorphs and uh of, of endomorphs and and uh mesomorphs training together so it's like the fast mesomorph jumping jacks and then the, sorry, the, the jumping lunges, and then it goes into the, in the endomorph slow push-ups. So we're getting a really good mixture today. While I've got the energy, we may as well use it because um, every day is how we take it, one day at a time. So have fun with it. We're going to warm up with, um, we're gonna warm up with, one second. Let me get that for you. All right, so our warm up is, 20 mountain climbers, 10 push-ups. I know I did this one the other day, but it worked so well. I thought it was the perfect way to warm up again and get the body moving and grooving. So what we're gonna do is the, again, 20 mountain climbers, 10 push-ups, 10 shoulder presses, and 10 kneeling get-ups. Are you guys ready? All right, let's go. 20 mountain climbers down on the ground. I'll do them so you guys can see me in the full vision. So, now like this, and remember 20 mountain climbers, we'll do this as double. So, one, uh, both legs is one. So, one, two, ready, go for it. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, take the knees out. Nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, almost there, 17, 18, 19, 20. From here, it's straight into push-ups. So just 10 push-ups, however which way, if that's on your knees, if that's on your feet, good on you, that's awesome. So from here, I don't know that all way. All right, from here, up, 10 push-ups, go for it. One, two, Five detox has got me a little bit weaker than normal. Six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. A little bit different. Some of you may have done a shoulder push up before. If not, that's okay. Follow along. Would love to hear how you go with it. All right, so shoulder push ups from here. Just walk out a little bit. Hands in a bit narrow, fingers pointing in, and from here just a little whoop. So it's just using the shoulders. Ready? Let's go. Ten of these. Ready, set, go. Bend the knees. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10. Stay down here with me, guys. Now we're going to go into 10 get ups. So, hands above the head. We're going to use one leg for five. Oh, no, you know what? Let's get alternating. Let's go one leg, other leg for 10 in total. This is warming up the whole body. Ready, set. Let's start with the right hand side. Go up one, 
back down on that leg, up on the other leg, back down on that leg, up on the first leg, back down on the first leg. And again, keep it going up, down, that's four, down, <laughs> lose my legs, up, down, that's six, up, down, up. If you're not warmed up after this, whew, last two, down, up, down. Nice, nice. Whew. How do we feel, guys? Bit of high energy, bit of goodness, bit of blood flowing. All right, so now that I've got that, I can come back over here. Technology. Hey, so now that we've done that, now we're going to jump into the workout. So oh, even I'm puffed on that one. So our workout is going to be one minute time trial of a jump lunge. Do what you can. If you get tired, do the jump lunge from here. Up, use your hands. Two, three, okay? If you get tired and you can't keep going, just step it through, okay? Just step it, keep on moving. Are we ready? I'm going to go this way, so I don't get close to that. Let's go one minute. Ready? Set. Step forward, in position, down, and use your hands. Go. Run. Nice and high. Woo. Keep it going. Good job, good job. Halfway. Last 15 seconds, guys. Two, one. Woo. 10 seconds to catch your breath, guys. 10 seconds to catch your breath. Whew, how is that? Feels good, feels good to be active. Ready for our next one is slow push-ups. So we're gonna slow the tempo down. Before we were being a meso more. Now we're gonna be an endo more. So, hands nice and wide in the push-up position. So we're gonna slow down. Are we ready? A whole minute. Go on your feet as much as you can, and then drop to your knees. Let's go. Slow and steady wins the race. Feel it the whole way up and the whole way down. Oh, I can't talk while I do that. Keep it up, keep it up. Nice and slow, really feel, feel the shoulder blades squeezing back together. Now feel the chest squeezing. Halfway. Last 10 seconds, guys. Come on, push it through. And done. Coming up, 10 seconds to rest. <sighs> Bring you down a bit so you can see me better. 10 seconds to rest. Deep breath, guys. How's everyone going on your Monday? What are we working on today? What are we aspiring to for the week? What's our goal? What's our objective? If you're from home, if you're stuck at home, you should definitely be doing this. If you've got kids at the moment, that's all right. Just take sh schedule in a time that you can do this afterwards. Get it done, send us a selfie if you're doing it. All right, alternating shoulder presses. Oh, sorry, alternating clean and press. So, choose your dumbbell weight. And from here, feet wide, knees out. We're going to come down, grab it with one hand, bring it up to the shoulder, above the head, bring it back down and change hands. Entire minute alternating through. Are we ready? Set. Let's go. Up, here, above. Back down to the ground. Use your bum. Up, here, back down to the ground. 
From this position, I'm keeping out and keep it up. Hold on for a minute. Up. Whoop. Above. Back here. Here. Above. Up. Back here. Keep it up. All the way through. First, above the head. Back down to the ground. Up. Above. To the ground. 25 seconds to go, guys. Up. To the ground. Back down. Up. Back. Down. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and done. Push that one out of the way. Get ready. We've got a wall hold. 10 seconds, catch your breath. Any questions? Let me know, but join in the fun, guys. Woo. Next one, one minute wall hold. Ready? So, coming down, find yourself a wall squat. Feet shot with the park. Not too far away, keep it pretty close. Back against the wall, and we're holding this position. Hopefully for a minute. If you get to a point you can't, come back up again. All right, keep it up, guys. Really push back. If you're finding yourself really struggling, maybe try lifting your toes, lifting your heels. I'll allow you, I'll allow you to lift the feet, break the cycle, push yourself. Okay? Push back. Squeeze your back muscles, squeeze the leg muscles. Core, chest up, shoulders back. Last 15 seconds. Five, four, three, two, and work your way up. Ooh, they are good. They burn really well. Beth Morsey, hello. Ooh. All right, guys. Ten seconds, and then we're gonna get into plank jumping jacks. Yeah, you guys have done those before. So it's in the plank position. And we're going to jump our feet as if we're doing a star jump, right? But we're on our hands. Ready? Let's go for an entire minute. Make sure you guys can see me. All right. On your elbows. Try not to have your hands out in front of you. They need to be, so your arms out in front of you. They need to be directly your elbows on your shoulders. And from here, it's just pushing it up. Try not to hunch back too much. Set, plank position, and a minute of jumping jacks. Go for it. One. If you need to stop and rest, drop your knees and then keep going again, guys. Just take a minute's breath and keep into it. Keep up that middle, let's go. The other one you could be doing is stepping out from the middle. If you can't do the jumps, just step inside the side. And if that's too much, then just hold a plank. Hold that position, hold, 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 hold. Push on through. Last 25 seconds, darling. Ideally, jumping jacks. Whichever mixture works for you. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Drop it down, stretch it out, guys. Go into that child pose. And you've got a two minute rest, guys. Bring the body back down. Deep breaths. Pull it back in. How are we feeling? That was round one. You guys have done so well. We'll probably get another round in, maybe two. Let's see how we go. How much time have you guys set aside for this? If you set aside half an hour, go three, four rounds easily. If you need to take two, three minutes rest in between, that's absolutely fine, guys. Not a problem at all. Ooh, grab a drink of water. Oh my God. I just found a spider web in the gym. It's really sad. You know what that means? Not been enough action in the gym. 
and all the creatures are crawling in. They have noticed that in quite a few workplaces that uh, there's spider webs developing in corners and amongst machinery while everything's shut down. Bit sad, but also kind of cool. All right, guys, a little bit longer, deep breaths in, rebalance yourself. If you're an activator or a connector, give me, I bet you can't do 20 mountain climbers and 10 jump squats. Go for it, activators and connectors. Show me your water, show, show me what you can do. Whew. All right, diplomats and guardians, you can do that too if you want to. If you want to catch your breath, you go right ahead. Very important that diplomats and guardians, you take your time. I say this every single workout, take your time. A uh, couple more seconds. Activators and connectors, push it, push it. All right, guys. Coming back into it, round two. So from here, we're going into our jump lunges. So, stepping forward one foot, you're gonna come down into a lunge, and then bounce up as high as you can and change legs. Are you ready? Set, and let's go. Jump lunges for a minute. If a minute's too long, guys, keep them up last time. If a minute's too long, feel free to drop it down to 30 seconds and just take one minute break in between or whatever, like in, at the end. Whatever you need to do to get through it, create it, I'll give you guys an idea, you nourish it the way you want to. But at the moment we're just doing the minutes. 25 seconds left to go. Take your time and really focus on getting high. Up oh, nice and high. Five, four, three, two, one. Woo! How's that burn? How is that burn? Feels good, guys. Feels good. Whew. All right, guys. Next, do you remember what's next? We have the push ups. So, nice and wide. Wide grip, so out nice and wide for these push ups. And we're going to go slow down, slow up. Hold me in that line. Coming up, let's go for it. One, two. Feel the squeeze through the shoulder blades. If you're feeling it tight in your neck, you're probably taking it up too high. Come, make sure your shoulder blades are down and back. Drop your knees when you need to. Continue that movement. If you're going from your knees, I want your chest to touch the ground and come back up. Go the full movement. Nice work, guys. 25 seconds left. A good one. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, finish it off, and one. Stretch your back. Coming up. Woo nice. How good is it feeling the blood pumping? Oh, deep breath in. Deep breath in, guys. All right. My next one is alternating dumbbell. If you don't have, um, we don't have dumbbells while we're catching our breath for a second. Let me just show you a variation. You could do from the ground, up, press, back down. Do the movement on one side for a couple reps or 30 seconds and then change to the other leg. Down, up, press, back. Okay? One version anyway. All right, let's get into it. Dumbbells at the ready. One minute, shoulder press, oh, sorry, clean and press. Dumbbell ready to go. Set, bum down, up to the shoulder and above, back to the ground. Shoulder, above, belly tight, bum tight. Change hands, up, back down, good. Up. Back down, and you really want to sort of like your hips scoop up and under to lift you up. 
If you're finding that stopping the shoulder is tricky, and you're just doing a straight clean all the way to the sky, you might be doing whew, one of these ones. If you feel comfortable with that and confident in doing it, whew, then you can do that. Just make sure you've got a tight core whew, and then everything is stable, slow and controlled through the movement, guys. Rest. 10 seconds. Look at all that talking. Up. Press. Back down. Up. Press. Back down. Go on. Can you fit one more in? Up. Press. Good job, guys. Good job. All right. Breathe deep. Pull the air in. The air in. So let it out again. The next is our wall hold. Yep. All right. Wall hold. So from here, we need the wall. I think we might be, by the way, while I'm catching my breath, we might be changing this time slot to a bit later again. Hey, Nat. So we're going to be changing this time slot to a little bit later again, potentially five o'clock Queensland time. So hopefully that time works out better for you guys. So here we're going in with the wall hold for a minute. So finding a wall, coming down, belly button in, and just while you're going through this process, do a lot of mental work in one of these. So it can just be starting your toes, front your toes. Push your heels into the ground. Squeeze your calves. Squeeze your knees. Squeeze your quads. Squeeze your glutes. Now go your belly. Now go your chest up and back. Shoulders away from your ears, shoulders blades against the wall. Starting your toes again. Squeeze your toes. Heels into the ground. Find your calves. What are your knees doing? Calves the quads. Belly button in nice and tight. Oh, we've got the glutes come back to the glutes, pull them tight. Belly button in, chest up and back, shoulder blades down and back. And look at that, we've got 25 seconds. Toes, heels, calves, knees. It just distracts you. Quads, glutes, belly, chest, shoulders down and back. Five, four, three, Two and walk it up. So let's go through there, guys, because that's for a guardian and a diplomat. It is super important that we work through strengthening. I don't know what's going on in this hair. Strengthening our joints and our ligaments. And our legs are quite often used the most out of everything. And so we actually need to strengthen our legs a lot, right? And our knees need that stability. They're used to holding such a magnificent, magnificent strong body. And so Sometimes it can mean that you need to have just a little bit of extra support in the ligaments through our day to day. So using things like wall holds are super important. Right, Woo. catch your breath guys. We're doing for a warm down guys. If you just, I wanna keep this to 20 minutes. So if you're playing along at home, do another round, go for it, do another round. But if it's safe today, safe to keep it to 20 minutes, I'm gonna go through stretching. How's that? So, stretching, let's start with, find a wall, leg up. You should've got a nice leg burn in all of that, right? That was great. Nice and tall. If you need to, kick your, head, your foot back into your hand, hand nice and tight like a tug of war. Push your back, if that's not doing enough, Maybe you can arch your back. Push, push, push. Bring your back in. Drop the leg, change legs. Leg up, nice and tight. Really feel that squeeze. Keep your chest up, belly button in and breathing through the movement. From here, if you want a bit extra, push into that foot. Push, 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 kick it back, kick it back. Nice. See how far you can go. Ooh, someone's tight on me. Coming back in, bringing it down. Let's stretch out our calves. So, one foot forward, bend the knee. One foot forward, straighten this leg. Bringing the foot back towards, apply a slight, a tiny bit of pressure through the, foot, the quad. Just a hand on there. Nothing too much. Stretch the toes back. Pull, pull, pull. This is just while we're standing so we don't need to be back on the floor again. You can do this from the floor as well. Changing sides. Ooh, 
that was a good session. We only did two rounds on the live, but if you want, we would love to see you do three or four rounds or five rounds. How much time are you dedicating to your fitness today? I'm going to try and keep this video nice and short for everybody. Shoulders. How cool are those shoulder push-ups as the warm-up? They're pretty intense, right? They're something that we do normal push-ups, but a shoulder push-up, that's all your body weight going through your shoulders. You don't need much more than that. Coming up. I hope you enjoyed today's workout. Is there anything you want to see more of? Let us know what you want. No, no, no. Everyone today that I've spoken to as clients have said how they found over the weekend they lost themselves, which is totally fine. But little workouts like this could be the difference of you feeling like you've lost it, but also then potentially regaining it. So for me, let's come down, breathe, breathe in. And bring it down and out. Stretch the thumbs out and back for a shoulder and chest stretch. Nice. And if you've still got that wall near you, if you haven't got balance, bring one knee up. Do those glutes. If you need the balance, that is. Bring it down, change legs. And pushing down. All right, guys. Awesome. Quick workout. I'm sweating. You should be sweating after that. Let me know how that felt, what you liked or what you didn't like. And um, enjoy the rest of your Monday. There's still plenty of hours to go for a walk, do some kind of methodical exercise, maybe walk with kids or the dogs, uh, get a really nice, delicious dinner prepared and share. We would love to see what you guys are creating at the moment, how you guys are keeping yourself fit, healthy and well. Uh, for me at the moment, I'm still on salads because I'm a diplomat doing a reset protocol, which means that I am having more salad. But I tell you what, guys, day five of our resets, 10 days for diplomats, 10 days of the reset protocol. And today's the day that I feel fantastic. Um, for the amount of stuff I've got going on on a Monday, it's um, amazing how energized I feel today with no coffee, um, which is great. So. Oh, your body is an incredible, incredible machine when you do the right things for it. So always come back to, if you have your pH for 60 profile, go back and look at the outputs. Go back and check what it's telling you for your food. Go back and check what it's telling you for your times, for your fitness. And um, I guarantee you, keep it simple and the, the program will support you no matter what. And so will I. <laughs> have a great Monday, guys. See you on the next call.